I don't know that there's any other program like this. The Garden to Table program was launched in 2010, and every year we've grown around 20,000 pounds of produce from community gardens for clients. And so a lot of people say that they don't need to use the food pantry in the summer because they get enough abundance out of their gardens. Hello, my name is Alpa. I'm the Garden to Table manager here at The Open Door. Since I've started, we've helped about 4,000 families grow their own food. The Garden to Table program essentially has garden plots that people can grow food at. Don't use that one. <laughs> well, hello there, future gardeners of Open Door. We have a great program here that will provide what you need to grow your own healthy organic vegetables. Everything for free. The free plot, free plants and seeds, tools, gardening classes, food preservation classes, and our own natural resources for people to grow their own food. The Open Doors fill their pantry and our refrigerator a number of times, and it's been really, really helpful in some really tough times. This program is important because it gives us a chance to take some pride in growing our own vegetables, and it's given us a chance to do that. Really got to get in the dirt and just work it, and then you learn so much so fast. There's two types of gardeners. There's the giving gardeners, which is what I am. So I'm given a plot and I'm given plants to grow for the pantry. And then there's also gardeners that if you don't have a big backyard, you can just have a plot and then you can grow your own veggies, which is what we're providing today. And just being outside, enjoying the weather like we are now, you come outside, take care of your plants, teach your kids how to grow some food. It's just fulfilling. I personally didn't really grow up loving gardening, <laughs> but with my nine-year-old, wanting to and loving it. I found out and I was like, well, I need to try it. So she was stoked when I told her. Kids sometimes have no idea where their food comes from and helping their parents grow their food, they can see that a tiny little carrot seed can grow into a carrot that they can eat that tastes just like the carrots at the grocery store. I like spending more time with my family and just having a garden and seeing all the watermelons grow. Watching children take this love of gardening with them will impact their children for generations to come. My favorite aspect of the garden to table is that we can grow stuff that goes to the food shelf so they can have fresh vegetables. Our packaging has been a really favorable thing for the open door. We have parishioners bringing in clamshells. And the really nice thing for the open door that is they literally just take it from us and put it out on the shelves. There's no labor required at the open door, so it works really smooth. I just thought of what if we grow a garden at our school? I mean, it would be something kind of fun, something we could all build together. And having more students see, this is like where my vegetables actually grow, and it's just amazing. All of the food is donated to the open door. And that's what this is all about, is just giving back to the community. It's important for people who have the gift of growing to do that in many different ways. We need farms for grocery stores and to feed millions of people. We also need people locally that can help people in their community grow. I would like to thank our generous donors for making this program possible. If you're interested in volunteering in the Open Doors Garden to Table program, please reach out. We'd love to have you. The community here has people from all different cultures and all different backgrounds. So if anyone is interested in having a plot of their own, you can go to theopendoorpantry.org and we'll get you started. Thank you for watching the video. Please share with your friends and family and we'll, and we'll see, see you, you next, next spring. spring.